This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what. About to get things going here on court number one again. Easton and Suxriana Tech out of Delaware. The Ravens as they will jump again. Got to see them a uh, time back in the Governor's Challenge here in Seasfield. Got to see Easton against Wagner and then in the Constellation bracket against Churchill a couple years ago. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to tip off thing one more time. Oh, maybe not. The shot clock was running again. They had to reset it. At 30, they do. As they say, third time's a charm. The tip off goes to the Ravens first. Here we go. Hopkins with it to start things off. They swing it back over to Frazier. Over to Roach. Top of the key three. That tipped and missed on the front end. The rebound to Moody, the junior guard here. As Moody drives to the hoop and gets the reversal to go. A quick two level lead for the Warriors. Heinz in here for Houston. That's a three from the top. No good. The ball should go back. Easton as well. It's a nice move about an hour away here, and you, you, you down here in the Eastern Shore area. Schools are pretty number, but it's spread around a little bit. That's a drive to the hoop. Back over, looking, pulls up, and short. <laughs> <laughs> Down over the spank hand. Almost lost it, got it back. Fakes the three. Shot clock at 14 with it, side with it. It's been out. Offensive rebound there and a fresh shot clock here. Out of bounds in the stage with the Ravens. A lot of movement there by Sasha and Attack. Both teams. First matchup of two in this short sure showcase. Deep three. Tip and miss. Defensive rebound there by Moody. Moody up the court. Up and over and in. Mixing with the second chance opportunity and he lays it in. Early 4 nothing lead here. Looking here. Looking to drive. Fades and hits. Fader fell the singer with that one and puts the Ravens on the board first. For them, anyway. It's a 4 2 game. That's a reach in inside. It's against Sasriana Tech. Coming up, we have. I'm going to take a little bit of a pause in between games. We'll be back with Sabat. Christian Academy in Glenelg Country first half, Parkville Logo second half. We expect them both to be barn burner games indeed. Turned over there. Back the other way comes the Ravens. Stolen back here by Moody. Moody inside. Got it in there. Early 6 2 advantage here for the Warriors. Inside, dish, back, and a whistle inside. Ball be inbounded here. Back here to game action now. How huge is it at the moment? Jump up. Air. And I mean all of it. All air. 
329 here left in the first. Someone lead on court two. That's Gaithersburg, I believe. In action. I got no big opponent off the top of my head. On our schedule sheet here. Fakes it, fakes it. Bounce pass. Bounce pass again. No good. Off the top there for next. Got the offensive rebound back. Moody kind of trapped in no man's land. Smartly knocked, had it knocked away on the other end. Wang around in New York. The front seven to three. Got to see them. So that tipped and missed there. Two forty-four remaining here in the third. Inside, off the glass and in. That was pretty huge there. That's an attack down one. D3, no. Offensive rebound, got it back. Chop it in, no good. Snatched away. The number's not in the favor of the Ravens. They're coming down. No. Offensive rebound there for the Ravens. Had it briefly. Moody kept his dribble there. Back. Pull up. Nailed it. Next play there by Nixon. He's able to get it to go. Face it. Drive. Inside, off the glass, no. Not there. Going back the other way. One ten remaining. Picked off. You know saying go had some many battery issues. We're back in the start of the second quarter here. Eastern up ten to nine in this one. Here over Sexuana Tech. Ravens, he was coming on strong there, not the first. He really was doing a good job to come on strong there, not the first. As we start the second quarter, the Mars Star hit with you. This is a short showcase game here in the 40th Governor's Challenge. Which, after our matchups at three, we're going to take it to Wakamako High School and then them all the University of Eastern Shore. Maybe back here for the end of the Mount St. Joe's matchup tomorrow evening. Dips and the dunk contest. Forgot about that. We're we'll doing that tomorrow night as well. Fakes it, swings it, shot clock at 10. Up, and right on the rail, out of bounds. And it goes back to the Ravens. Looking here, swings it back. Open three. I tip the miss. Rebound back the other way. Dish, layup. Nixon got it. How about that? 12 9 now is your score. As the Warriors up three. Drive. Bounce pass. Fakes it. There's Roach. Up. Block and foul. How many in the action shooting? 650. Here left in the first half. Easton holding on to a 12 9 game. So we was wrong in that aspect. Not the action shooting. And it's a 13 foul on Easton. Only one on Luciana Tech. Fakes it here. Ball stays. Stays with the Ravens. Try 
to re set things on the shot clock in. We had 27. Swings it. Open three. No, that would have tied the game. Offensive rebound, though, however. Deep three. No. And another chance again for the Ravens. Deep three one more time. Yes. Three's enough then. Donald St. Fraud with the three. He ties it at 12. Looking to drive. Doubled in the corner. Doubled in the corner. Got it out. Floater. Off the glass. Bailey with his second field goal of the game. 14-12 as Easton back up to. Wagner up on Gaithersburg right now. 11 to 10 is up on their own court number uh, two. Jumper. In and out. Rebound back the other way to Easton. Doubled. Barely turned it over. The bad part is, got it back in time. Blocking foul. Looking to pass. That's a 14 foul on Easton. Back here in the game action now. Long pass there, fakes it. Looking. Swings it back. Shot clock down to 20. Looks like a 5 10. Right here in the first half. Inside, we're tied. St. Bard has most of the points here for the Ravens. We're tied at 14, five minutes left. Here in the first half. Looking here. Double swings it back. We're gonna drive inside, roll go. Roll one in there. And it's 16 to 14 to score. Brings it back. Deep three. No. Rebound back the other way. Looking to drive. Inside is Moody. All the way to the basket and in. Moody makes it a four point game for Easton. 18 to 14. In 2A. D3. Tipped and missed there from Thompson. Reaching there against Susquehanna Tech. 4 1 left here in the first half. 18 14 to score. Then lost in translation, got it back. Low again, this time it is stolen for good. Is that attack trying to make this a one point game with a three? Swings it, open three. No. Batted back around. Moody able to keep his dribble. Moody to the basket. He might have been able to get a two shot call in. Look like he will. <coughs> Two. Three twenty-two left here in the first half. We'll be right back with you. One of two at the line, the lead now to five, nineteen to fourteen. Brings it back. Lost it. Ball back the other way. Inside. Moody got it in there. 21 to 14 to score. Easton in front by seven. Looking here. Swings it over. Fakes the jumper. 
travel. So I said for Johnson, he didn't take it. They made him pay the piper with travel. Seven point lead here for Easton. Looking, open three. Tipped and missed. Rebound there back. Santa Claus, the, the senior has really offensively carried the weight here for the Ravens. Swings it, open three again. Off the backboard this time, no good. Coming back the other way, inside the road goes in there. For Raheem Hatt. Time out. A Susurana attack. They're down by nine. Two eleven left here in the first half in the show showcase matchup. All right, folks, we're back to game action now. I see. Yeah. A little slick spot there off the court. Susurana attack had to take a timeout. They're down nine here. And this one against Easton. 23-14, here's your score. Swings it. Dips it. Back. Floats it up. Missed it off the glass. And the offensive rebound. In the corner there, track is Hopkins. The ball stays. With us around attack out of Delaware. Tech. You know, most of the Delaware teams were near that Delaware line, so it's really not that far for them to come. 154 remaining here in the first half. In this one, the refs give a little talking in the air. It's a day three of action here in the Governor's Challenge. It's right here at the halfway mark here. Fakes it. Swings it, open three. No. Clears the rebound there, big time. It's Bailey. Bailey clears the rebound. One thirty-five left here in the half. East has been able to make such an attack play their pace. Here a ball. Drive. Tough. And Bailey. The freshman gets it to go. And the lead up to 11 now, 25-14. Thompson, bounce pass over. Swings it back. Swings it inside again. Tried to dip it inside. And the ball stolen back. Easton had it briefly and the Ravens get it back. Swings it, jump up, boom! Airs from Dayton, Virginia, he cuts the lead eight. Fakes it, swings it, inside, stolen. Back, Easton stole it back. The first so no, let's get that one to go. Whistle there against Easton S. There, 15 foul. Fouls will not matter at this point. With 22.2 seconds left here in the half. Very paced first half for Easton. As for Comico, Queen Anne's County did get a couple of shore showcase wins here for the Maryland side of the shore things. Delaware has dominated though in the shore showcase so far quite a bit. Shot clock is all the game clock at six, five, four, three, two, try to dish it in, no good. Not there, and that's half. Half time here on court one in this short showcase game. 25 to 17, your score here for Easton. They're up by eight, and we're back with the second half. Coming back at you here from the Governor's Challenge. This is Die Sporting Network.